Hey guys, it's me, Ejen, and this is my video blog for February 2013. So first of all, I'd like to thank everybody for coming out to my New Jersey exhibition reception. Yes, if you guys didn't know, I had a reception at the Nancy Dreyfus Gallery located in the Library of Keene University in Union, New Jersey. So um, the exhibit's actually still up, so if you are actually anywhere near Keene University, you should go by and check it out. So uh, I believe this is the largest turnout that the college ever had for an art exhibit and I'd like to thank Kathy of Otaku Anime Society for shepherding this whole thing together so I can give her a hand you know uh, I'd like to thank everybody who came out because you know what that week was one of the coldest weeks in recent history like it, it was plunging to 15 degrees so I am very appreciative for everybody who came out because dude it was cold outside I'm surprised that many people came out because uh, it was cold, <laughs> you know, so um, I think Gina B came from the furthest away because she came from Long Island. I could be mistaken. There are a lot of people there, so I may not know where everybody came from, but I think that's right. Uh, I also want to thank everybody for coming out to my New York City meetup. Uh, this is actually kind of interesting because I kind of want to do this thing where it was kind of an informal meetup. Um, I've been to New York before, but I've never really like gone to all comic book, you know, check out the geek scene. So I thought it'd be fun to have a bunch of people kind of show me around. So we did that for about five, six, seven hours or something like that. Uh, maybe more like six hours. We had about 25, 20 to 25 people over the course of the day. Uh, some people left early, some people came late. You know, some people came and left within a few, within an hour, you know. So we went to... Uh, let's see, where did we go to? Kino Kaniya, Book Off, uh, Midtown Comics, uh, Nintendo World, and Anime, uh, Image, Image Anime. So, I know we missed a bunch of other places like Forbidden Planet and Jim Hanley's Universe and uh, what else? To Toy Tokyo. So, we couldn't hit everything, but I think it was pretty interesting for the turnout of this. So, uh, that was fun. And that was cold too. Sorry, I'm from the South. I'm from Texas. I live in Los Angeles. Cold weather is kind of, you know, like, I don't like cold weather. But the funny thing is, the longer I was in New York, the more I got used to the cold weather. After a while, it wasn't that bad. But the first few days, I was like, ugh. And I feel cold right now. And it's only 60 degrees. Yes, I am a big wuss. Completely, you know. Okay, so, uh, as you guys know, I will not be at KatsuCon. My new motto for this year is Real World Comes First. Uh, I had decided not to go, and then I was going to secretly show up, but then I found out that I, well, I got booked on a two-day gig during that weekend, so I'd rather go and make money to pay bills than go to a con right now, because, well, Real World Comes First. So, lucky for me, I flew Southwest, so you can actually hold the money that you spent on an airline ticket and use it for future flights, so I decided to use it two weeks later for Emerald City Comic Con. That's right, I'm going to Emerald City Comic Con. This year, besides Real World Comes First, is I'm going to go more Comic Cons. Oh, somebody... No? Yeah? No? Ding. My Facebook makes noises. So, uh, yes. So this is going to be... be, 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 be Let's try it again. This will be a bit different because what's going to happen is... I have books. <laughs> the funny thing is, I just came from Anaheim, and I, I have a friend down there. And it turns out I, he has a, like a few boxes of my books, and I didn't even know he had a few boxes of my books. So I have a few more books, uh, a few more boxes of books. So I will bring some books with me. And oh wait, where is it? Where? Dang it! Oh. There we go. Okay. I guess this is a new thing I have now. It's a, it's like a 5 by, oh, I'm sorry, this is a 7 by 5 cosmetic bag with Chibi Ejin on it. And I also have a Chibi Ejin uh, mouse pad. So, you know, extra little stuff. Um, and of course, I'll have my book Cosplay America. But what's going to be different about MOC Comic Con is I'm only going to be in the uh, dealer hall for three hours on Friday, I'm sorry, Saturday and Sunday. That's right, that's only three hours. So the only way you can find me is to come into the dealers. They open at 10 a.m. and I'll be gone at 1 p.m. Uh, I'm going to go and explore the place and take pictures and just hang out. So um, 
I will be with the Epic Cosplay Wigs, so find their wig booth and you'll see me there. So just remember, Saturday, Sunday, uh, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. I'm sorry, <laughs> 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Uh, the other thing that I should let you guys know is I'm bringing limited amount of stuff with me. I'm not bringing, I usually bring a lot more stuff when I'm there the whole day, but since I'm kind of trying to do more of a vacation con, in a way, I'm only working half the time, in a way. So, I guess what I'm trying to say is, if you want my book or any of the stuff, come on Saturday, because if I run out, then I'm not showing up on Sunday. Well, I mean, I'll be at the con, I just won't be at the Epic Cosplay Wigs booth, okay? Um, and, of course, two weeks after that, I'll be in Megacon in Orlando, Florida, for, well, Megacon. Uh, it's been the... It's been over a year since I've been there, so I kind of want to go back to Florida. And uh, I'll tell you the truth, the rest of the year is kind of up in the air. New York Comic Con, yes. San Diego Comic Con, yes. Dragon Con, yes. Everything else is a big maybe. And that even includes AX and Otacon, because I'm really kind of scaling back. I, I, I got a bit burnt out, and I'm just kind of scaling back. And I'm just trying to go to more comic book conventions, because there's cosplay there, too. Now, some cosplayers only cosplay at comic book conventions, and they, go, they don't go to anime conventions. Some go to anime conventions, and they don't go to comic book conventions. And some go to both. So, I kind of want to go and explore more of the comic book uh, cosplay this year. Um, mostly because when I grew up, uh, I read comic books and watched anime. I mean, I'm kind of part of both worlds, in a way. Even though I haven't read comic books in a while, and I haven't watched anime in a while. So... Anyway, that's pretty much it. Uh, you can just follow me on Facebook and you will know exactly what's going to happen. So Facebook, uh, you know what? All the links are down there. And that's about it. Uh, oh, also, Anime Matsuri. I actually don't think I'm going to go to Anime Matsuri. I might pull that back and go to Akon instead. So uh, <laughs> this is going to be the year where my schedule gets really hectic because the Emerald City Comic Con thing only happened last night. It only happened because, number one, I found a cheap fare. Number two, I knew people who would be there so I can crash with them and I just decided to just do it. So, and also because I wasn't going to Katsukon, so I figured I should just kind of like balance it out with something else. So instead of going back to DC, I'm gonna go to Seattle instead. And then I'm gonna go to Florida. And then I don't know where I'm going after that. But anyway. Okay guys, thanks a lot. Catch y'all later.